In Steamboat Springs, Colorado, the Green family thought the only skunk left under their home was a dead one. But they've just discovered a live one is still there, and the skunk expert can't get at it. I was so frustrated because the live ones were supposed to be gone. The Greens can't understand why their home is infested with skunks. Skunks are seen all across the United States and are equally common in rural, suburban, and urban areas. They're found everywhere. Most people don't even realize they're around. When I returned a week later, the scent in the home was very bad. It just hits you in the face. Jake is unwilling to send Carly back under the house, so he looks for another way to get to the crawl space. He locates the dead skunk, but can't reach it. There's only one way to get to the carcass. We were going to have to tear this entire floor completely out. You are kidding me. Our floors all have to be ripped up from skunks. Jake is shocked by what he finds. They actually constructed a labyrinth of tunnels underneath the home. All kinds of little tunnels and twists and turns and areas where they had made nests. It definitely by far is the worst skunk problem that I had ever seen. Skunks have built an extensive colony directly under the Green's home. It was a five-star skunk resort. It was just a very nice place for skunks to live. As long as the tunnels remain in place, new skunks will find them and continue to colonize under the Green's house. The only solution? Destroy the tunnels. We had made it down about four feet down into the dirt. And that's when we found it, a big, old, nasty skunk. Jake has discovered the source of the unbearable stench. This was the guy that had been causing all this problem all this time. Nine months after the first infestation, with the colony now destroyed, the Greens can finally return home. It was the first time in a long time that you would go and you would open the door to the house and walk in, and it didn't smell. It's pretty incredible for my kids to be home again, to be back in their house, and there's just their surroundings and everything. It's a really good feeling.